guys. So, I'm recovering from being sick. I had a cold. I guess I still have a cold because I literally was blowing my nose like 10 minutes ago. But, um, I went to the soup today, which means market in Arabic. And I bought some things and I wanted to show you guys before I got to bed. I had a nice long day, but I really enjoyed myself. I bought some nice things. And, um, I just, this is my first time going to the market out here. And I have been to other African markets, um, in Sudan. Yeah, just in Sudan. Oh, sorry. Burping. But yeah, so I just want to show you guys the things that I got. Um, one of them being this this hooded house dress I'm wearing right now. I put on this red lipstick to match. Even though these flowers are actually kind of like pinkish. But yeah, I got this. It's long. As you can see. It's long goes all the way down to the ankle. Hooded, thick, and warm for like those cold Egyptian nights. Because it is cold, I have the heater over there at the foot of my bed for for warmth, of course. So I'm going to show you the things that I got. One of them being this perfume. It smells really good. I went to a boutique in the market. Even though I have a cold, I can smell things. So this is like a fruity scent. The guy said it was called Sparkle. I just, show, I just showed him. I just told him I want, like, beautiful scents. Like, show me the nicest ones you got. So, he showed me something called chocolate, chocolata, and then one called sparkle. And they both smelled really good to me. So, I said, can you combine them? But I want the majority of the scent to be sparkle. So, this bottle was 80 Genade, which is, um... I'm trying to do the conversion. Y'all know I'm not good at math. Eighty <sighs> Jimmy. Walk along with me. Which is eighty. I don't know, but um, eighty Jimmy is about. It just means eighty pounds here. I'm not sure the conversion, but if you're curious. Whatever 80 Egyptian pounds to dollars, that's the equivalent to what I paid. But it's not much. This is actually one of the bigger bottles they had. They had ones that was 25, 35, 50, 55. And then they had these really pretty bottles. I was going to get the, um, I think the 50 or the 35 bottle, which was tall. But this bottle was just so pretty. I said, let me have this one instead. So I paid extra just for the aesthetic of this bottle because it is very beautiful. I wish I had a label. It's plain. It's awfully plain. But it has a really pretty ombre pink gradient effect and a nice gold rim around the cap. There's the cap. It smells so good, I swear. So I got this perfume. Let's call it chocolate sparkles. I would say that, but it's like if you smell it, it doesn't smell a lot like the the chocolate, the scent that they mixed in. The majority of this is sparkles, so I don't, I really wouldn't know what to call it. So let me put this down here so I can better show. Um, take this off. I have my hair in two like French braids, a little fuzzy. But, yeah, so I got this, like I said, 80 Genade. I also got two bras. One of them I'm actually wearing. The other one I'm just not going to show because it's a bra, like whatever. It's pretty though. But, I know some may be watching this. I don't need y'all fantasizing about me. Anyways. Let me show this beautiful Islamic clothing that I got. Where's the scarf for it? I wore the scarf earlier. Look how pretty. Very regal. 
Give me the tag. This one was expensive. Let me see if I remember the price. The price is written. It was 470 Jeanaid. Which is a lot. Um, at least a lot for there. But 470 is like. I'll say like $40. Could be more or less. But if you really want to know, I would say go to like Google for the conversion. Whatever 470 Egyptian pounds is in dollars, that's the price of this. But this stands up so you can see it better. Let me get on the couch. Okay. It's quite long. It fits from the bottom. It has a nice belt that also matches. Very pretty. And a scarf that goes with it. This is the scarf. <coughs> Excuse me, please, because like I said, I was sick. I'm still sick. I am sick. And I've been sick for three days now. I have a cold. Um, yesterday and the day before was really bad, especially the day before. I was very severe. I was very weak, chills. It was like a flu, but it was just like a really severe head cold. But yeah, this is the scarf. It's embellished on one side and the other side is plain. So when they do it like this, this is the side that hangs out. I'll just put it on so you can see. What it will look like and I'm sure a lot of you have never seen a hijab dressed up before like applied so I did it like that this is the way I've been tying my scarf since I was 10 years old and yes I've been wearing a hijab since 10 years old so 15 years I've been wearing hijab, but look how pretty that is, very nice. This is like a, this is like a, a gown, I mean gown, this is like an ibaya, this Islamic dress is called ibaya. This is the type that, like this fancy type is the kind that you wear for holidays, for weddings, you know, it even has these nice black shiny rhinestones, it's very pretty, I love it. I also got another one similar to this but more casual and, <clears throat> and this has the scarf actually attached this is actually something that you wear to pray but it's a little fancy and I wouldn't be wearing this in the house I could wear this in the house to pray but I'm gonna wear it also in the street like you know because remember My throat is just messing with me. I had a sore throat too the first day. Anyways, because you know I don't have much clothes with me, I accidentally left a suitcase behind in the U.S. If you didn't hear that story, go to my video where I talk about, what's it called? I made it to Africa, but encountered many problems on the way. And that's the name of the video, part one. I just love it. It's so pretty. I wore the scarf earlier, actually, with this purse. With this nice, pearly, silver swoosh bag that I have. Doesn't that go so nicely together? I know, I'll be styling. But yeah, it came in this bag. These outfits. So this is the second one. Same thing, long black and this is the design I might get clowned by people if they notice that this is like home prayer wear but I don't care because you know first of all it was inexpensive compared to this one this was 110 pounds and the fancy one that we just looked at this was 470 so, I mean, obviously this is more fancy because of the more intricate design and all the appliques on it. 
it costs more obviously but there's about a 360 pound difference in price so you can see why this is more casual and how this is considered something for the house but I mean I don't be wearing pearly clothes like this in the house I wear something more casual with like you know maybe a printed design not something very delicate like this this is why I was like you know what <laughs> I'm about to get this and wear it outside can't nobody tell me nothing yeah and this is a scarf it's actually attached so same way I tied my scarf if you had this you put one side in <laughs> like that and tie it over and if you have a pin which I have many pins you stick it in and so on so I got these two also very nice with pink on it you know I love pink I got um, a pink sports bra that I'm wearing I guess I'll show it whenever it's pretty because if anybody who's watching this they're you know planning to move to Egypt or Africa if you're in a Islamic country you'll have like similar options of clothing you could find things like this but this is the bra I got it's just glue lace it's actually not the right size the size on it is like the size is in America but the size is not accurate so I don't know if I'm gonna give this away to somebody or not but it's cute I do plan on losing some more weight so maybe it'll fit me later on what else did I get the perfume and then this I'll show this better now. Put this back. Okay, I'll you see it well. So, baggy, you know, and very cozy. It's like a velour texture i think it is velour actually yeah it kind of looks like it this looks like the material that um they use for those tiger blankets i really did this so funny but yeah it's really pretty i'm cold i'm gonna have some water excuse me one second guys bismillah All of the all of the waters at the bottom. I just sure can't pick it up. Oh, there's a piece of ice. Yeah, I put this in the freezer earlier. It's so cold. Y'all did not see that waterfall on me. Two bras, two ebayas, this. I got a pair of gloves. <clears throat> Very nice black gloves. Like if you've ever seen Muslim women that wear ebaya, like this Islamic dress, usually if they wear a veil, they often have gloves on, like long black gloves. I went to go visit a friend nearby. Excuse me, and I got back about an hour ago. So. keep burping I got back about an hour ago but we were sitting in the garden and I took off my gloves to drink my tea and I left the gloves on the couch like in the garden so when I'm in the taxi going back here home I'm like where the fuck's my gloves and I can't find it in my bag you know this bag and I'm like maybe I can't see it because in the taxi it's dark you know and I felt for it, and I'm like, oh shit, I left it there. So I don't know if I'm going to try to get it for my friend tomorrow or Friday. I know he said he was free Friday, so I may go over for some tea then. But I love all the things I got today. Oh, how much was this? Let's see if I can remember. This was 90 pounds, this long house dress. Yeah, it was 90 pounds.
my favorite thing is the perfume you'll know i'm a perfume freak i love my perfumes i love pretty fragrances and this is a nice decent size this bottle looks sort of big but really where it starts is here it ends here so i don't know how much I should have asked her how many milliliters this was it says four on the bottom so that might mean that it's four ounces it probably is it's pretty heavy this might be about four ounces of liquid which is a decent amount because this size and you know perfume in america depending on the brand of course can be up to what can be at least maybe like 40 or up dollars so I like the things I got. I also got this pretty rose from my friend's garden. Look how pretty. Everything is just matching. I'm going to put that in my ear. With my hood on. That's cute. Let's see how it is in my hair. Señorita Cadicha. When people who speak Spanish say my name, they be like Kadija. There you guys go. The secret is out. First class Kiki's real name is Khadija. There you go. But don't be calling me that. My name is Kiki. Okay? Oh, my little flower fell. But yeah. Um, if anyone's curious about the things that I saw at the market, like what's available for sale and things like that, I can tell you, um, what I did see if they had clothing for men, women, children, boys, girls, um, shoes all over the place. There were some sandals, these cute, they look like Birkenstocks, but not Birkenstocks. It was just that slide on Birkenstock style, you know, the two straps and it was white. It was more like a cream color. It was like off white. And they had like black Eiffel Towers on it, and they had pink, um, pink roses, and butterflies. It was so cute. Like I loved everything about it except for the Eiffel Towers. I don't give a damn about France. And I told the guy like, oh, you know, I want one. You know how much are they? He gave me the price of thirty five. I tried to bargain down. He said he can't do more than thirty five. So I'm like, okay, whatever. So, me and my neighbors, my friends that I went with, we were in a store nearby, and we were there for a while. And that's when I found the more casually buy of this one. I'm going to wear this tomorrow to go visit some neighbors. What is this random string for? Oh, <laughs> shame on me. It's to tighten the sleeve. But yeah, so I went to, um, I went to that store that they were looking at. At, and that's when I bought that and we were just basically in the area where that shoe store was shoe shack I guess you could say because it was outdoors and um, I was like you know what I'll pay 35 for that those slippers are cute so I went back and I'm like I need this out de Latin, which means 39 because here they go by European sizes and 39 is like eight in America eight in women's so he's like I don't have eight in the one with the pink flowers i only have 38 which is seven and i tried it on it was too small like i can put my foot in it or whatever but I, I wanted a little bit more space like it did not fit it wasn't the right size it was a size down so he's like i have 39 and these are the color i'm like no les and bimbi which means it must be pink like you know i love pink and i love flowers so i'm wearing this floral dress i got these floral other dresses is this flowers yeah these are flowers i love flowers roses specifically and i love pink so i had to have what i was looking for and they did not have the one i wanted in my size and i was not willing to get blue they also had like a light brownish kind of um, one with that color flower and they had yeah that was it um in my size I'm like no I want the pink one and I actually don't recall seeing those slippers at another store like another store in the market and the market is open ear like you know it's just little sections 
scattered all over the place. Some are on tables, some are in walk-in shacks, you know. So I wasn't sure if I was going to find those slippers at another place because unlike in Sudan, this market here in Luxor, they have a wide variety of clothing, wide variety of shoes. I wasn't looking too hard at the shoes because I wasn't necessarily looking for shoes, but they have a lot of options. At least the place I bought this fancy Ibaya, they literally had stacks like of Ibayas on top of each other. They had so many options and all of them were beautiful. Like, like I didn't see anyone that wasn't bad. Like, let's say somebody were to give me one for a gift. Any one of them I would have taken, you know. I wouldn't personally buy any one of those because some of them are pretty. Most of them are pretty. But they're not all in my style. But if I was gifted one, like if I didn't pay for it, I would take one of those in there. But if I have picked it up myself, I wouldn't mind getting... Um, I mean, obviously I bought one from them. They have a lot of nice options. They have a lot of nice options. But, of course, they are a little bit more expensive because this is more of a... A dressy type of um, a buyer. This this type of a buyer they would wear to a wedding, like I said, or for a the holiday. So what else? I think that's all that I got. Yeah, I keep forgetting like the gloves, the two buyers, the two bras, and that's it. Yeah, guys. So thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I think I'm going to do my upbringing video. This has been on my mind for a while to do this. So I think I might do it. I have the energy. So I may get a nice glass of water. Not so cold as this one. Because the thermos, this Brita thermos. Well, it's not a thermos, but it's just a stainless steel filter bottle. But it keeps um, water very, very cold. Like, I took this out the freezer in the morning, and it still has, like, a chunk of ice, you know, in the bottom. So, yeah. My friend is calling me on Snapchat. So, yeah, guys. Bye.